Hello guys, and today we're going to be doing another mod tutorial, and this one's a spooky mod that many of you, many of you probably know, and it's called the Slender mod. Now, Slender is a game, um, what, I don't really know what it is, it's just a game where you run around the woods and you have to run away from this guy who keeps trying to kill you or something, or f ugh, I don't know. It's a good game though, and it's pretty scary, and <laughs> if you want to see it, um, go type it in and watch it, it's pretty cool. Um, but I'm going to show you how to get it from Minecraft, and this basically works exactly the same. You'll be spawned into a forest, and it will be dark constantly, I think. And this person will try and kill you, or something like that. Okay, so, to get this mod, just come to the first link in the description and download the EXE. Second thing you want to do is go to MC Nostalgia, and download um, the MC Nostalgia. Once you've done that, you want to go find your downloads folder, and when uh, when they're both installed, what you want to do is you want to drag your Slender mod onto your desktop. Unfortunately, because I'm doing something on my desktop, I have no idea what, it's just not working for me today. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a new folder, and call it MCN. Now, this is where you want to drag, open up your RAW file and drag all of it into that folder from the um, MC Nostalgia. Now, you can call it whatever you want, doesn't matter, as long as you make a folder. You probably don't even, you do need to make a folder just so it's on your actual computer, kind of there. So, first thing you want to do is make sure you've got a fresh Minecraft, um, Minecraft is um, fresh, before you use the MC Nostalgia. Um, and to check this, you want to log in. And if it comes out of 1.4.2, then you're okay. So, click on this and then go to this one, the MC Nostalgia EXE, and click on that. Now, when it comes up with Enter, press Enter. Or comes up with that, press Enter. And then this mod is for um, 1.3.2. So, you want to go to the number 117 and press Enter. Enter. And it will download the patch. Now, funnily today, that's the Spartan number someone put in the comments. And Halo 4 has come out today, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know. I'm not really a fan of the new Halo, but Halo is out today. It's cool. So when it says successfully installed, you know it's done. So that um, means you can just press enter to exit. If it says anything else, just open up your dot .minecraft, delete it, and try again. Otherwise, I'm not sure. Um, if that doesn't work, please um, tell me what bit your computer is. I'm using 64. If you're using 32 and it doesn't work constantly, then I'm not sure. Maybe the install is um, slightly buggy for that 32-bit. Um, okay, so then what you want to do is, is when it's... Um, you double-click on the installer, and it'll come up with this, and you install the mod. And don't back up your Minecraft, because you've already used MC Nostalgia, which refresh and resets it all anyway. So if you want to um, keep your stuff, then do it before you use the MC Nostalgia. So, you just have to wait for this thing to install, and then you can crack on with it. It does take a little while, um, the installers are a little bit, um, slow, but, I mean, if you want to do it manually, that's fine. You can just download the zip, use mod loader, and find out if you need MP or forge. It normally says on the, um, page, so that's fine. So, it's always done as it says, and that's it. Um, send a mod installed. So, then you just run your Minecraft. You can keep, now, keep this open the first time if you want, it's up to you. Um, I always keep it open, but for example, when you close it off, it will always come up with a message. This always happens with the installers, it doesn't matter, um, what happens, it will just do this. This is just part of the installer anyway. Anyway, so, if it does do that, um, just press cancel, it doesn't matter, it doesn't do anything. It's just an installer bug. Now, you always get a little black screen, so don't worry about that, and then it will save mode. Now, you know it's worked, because it says three mods are install, um, active and installed, and Minecraft Forge, etc. So, I know it's worked now, because that's a 100% guarantee. Um, if you want too many items with this, just download too many items. Too many items isn't difficult. If you want, you can um, go watch a video on it. But that's it from me, guys. I hope you found this useful, and you will um, install this mod and have some fun with it. And don't crap yourself. Um, 
it probably won't be that scary. Um, the actual stand is quite scary, but it's pretty cool. Um, if you want to watch that, you can watch it on the Yogscast. Duncan plays it, so you just type in Duncan plays Slender or um, anyone else that you want to do. Um, and that's it from me, guys. Hope you enjoyed and found this useful. Please like and subscribe, and that's it. Goodbye.